thrombotic thrombocytopenic purpura, often referred to as TTP, is a rare, serious blood disease that results in many small blood clots forming throughout the body. Typically, blood clot formation starts the tissue injury. Right away, some cells begin to release a protein called von Willebrand factor. This von Willebrand factor sticks to exposed fibers in the torn tissue and becomes like glue, allowing platelets to stick to the site. As the platelets pile on top of one another, they link together into a mesh, which we call a clot. In TTP, there is often a severe deficiency of the enzyme Adam TS13, which breaks down von Willebrand factor when it's no longer needed. Without this von Willebrand factor regulation by Adam TS13, small blood clots can form more frequently throughout the body. The small blood clots formed in a person with TTP can block normal blood flow through arteries and veins, leading to clinical findings that include decreased platelets, increased red blood cell destruction, and neurological issues such as headaches, mental changes, confusion, speech abnormalities, partial paralysis, seizures, or coma. TTP can cause a wide range of other symptoms. Due to the low number of platelets, small areas of abnormal bleeding in the skin may occur, which can be seen as a rash-like appearance or a purplish discoloration. Other symptoms may affect the entire body, including fever, weakness, fatigue, and extreme paleness. There can also be episodes of unusually heavy bleeding or abdominal pain accompanied by nausea and vomiting. Acute kidney failure occurs in less than 10% of people with TTP and requires dialysis. Due to the lack of blood and urine filtration when the kidneys stop working properly, increased water, salt, and protein retention can occur, causing an onset of symptoms within days including foot swelling, shortness of breath, headaches, fever, and an irregular heartbeat. Although the exact cause of TTP is unknown, it's associated with a deficiency of Adam TS13, an enzyme which breaks down the clotting protein called von Willebrand factor. Without sufficient levels of Adam TS13 in the blood, large pieces of von Willebrand factor can move around the blood and increase platelet clotting and red blood cell destruction. There are two types of TTP, immune-mediated and congenital. The more common type is immune-mediated TTP, also called ITTP, an autoimmune disorder that usually develops in late childhood or adulthood and is also called acquired TTP or ATTP. In ITTP, a person's immune system attacks the Adam TS13 enzyme, decreasing the amount of it in the blood. Congenital TTP, also called familial TTP or CTTP, is present at birth and is inherited in an autosomal recessive pattern. Both parents must carry an abnormal variant for the Adam TS13 gene in order for a child to be born with CTTP. Children with CTTP have very low levels of the Adam TS13 enzyme. A quick diagnosis of TTP is important to reduce serious complications. A clinician may evaluate a person for TTP by their signs and symptoms, medical history, and conducting a physical examination. When the clinical evaluation indicates TTP, a diagnosis can be confirmed through blood tests showing a deficiency of less than 10% Adam TS13 activity and, for ITTP, the presence of anti-Adam TS13 antibodies. The most common treatments for TTP are plasmapheresis, steroids, and the drug rituximab. Plasmapheresis is the process of exchanging plasma through a machine. First, a person's blood is removed, then the plasma is separated from the blood cells and healthy plasma is placed into a person's blood. For TTP, plasmapheresis removes anti-Adam TS13 antibodies and then adds back the Adam TS13 enzymes. If a person has a large number of anti-Adam TS13 antibodies, rituximab, a drug that can decrease the production of anti-Adam TS13 antibodies, may be given through an intravenous infusion.
Thrombotic thrombocytopenic purpura is a serious, rare blood disorder characterized by an increased number of blood clots formed in the smallest arteries throughout the body. The major symptoms of TTP include decreased platelets, increased destruction of red blood cells, and neurological problems. The cause of ITTP is unknown. However, it often occurs with a deficiency in Adam TS13, an enzyme that breaks down a clotting protein called von Willebrand factor. Congenital TTP is a rarer type of TTP that is inherited in an autosomal recessive pattern. After a clinical evaluation, a diagnosis of ITTP can be confirmed through blood test results showing a low amount of the Adam TS13 protein and anti Adam TS13 antibodies. A diagnosis of CTTP can be confirmed by the absence of these anti-Adam TS13 antibodies. The most common treatments for ITTP are exchanging plasma through plasmapheresis and using an antibody called rituximab, while CTTP is treated most commonly with plasma infusions.